What is up gamers and haters and welcome back to Twisted Beer Gaming. I am the Twisted Beer Gamer and today as you guys can see we're going to play some Titanfall. Um, but before I get into that I did want to say if you guys have not seen our latest videos uh, or do not know who we are, um, in the description below there are some links to our latest videos. We have a wide range from anywhere from Call of Duty montages to some Minecraft to some Let's Plays all the way now to some live commentary for uh, Titanfall here. Um, the other thing I wanted to talk about is we are on Twitter as well as Facebook. The links for that will also be in the description below. Uh, come give us a follow and a like, that would be awesome. Uh, also real fast too, uh, one of the latest updates is Black Ninja 901 If you do not know who he is, link for his YouTube will be in the description below. Very awesome commentator. I feel like he's kind of the voice for us gamers. Very good at what he does. Uh, go give him some support, that would be very awesome. Uh, so let's get into this here, Titanfall. Got this yesterday, getting my first chance to play this today. Very excited for this, very good game. Got through the training and a couple matches into this. Uh, I, I am blown away, guys. I think this is way better than Call of Duty, in my opinion. Definitely, definitely liking this. I do have it on the Xbox One. I don't really have anybody to play with. Um, if anybody's interested in playing with me, uh, my gamer tag obviously is Twisted Big Gamer. Very, very willing to play with anybody. Um... I, the things I like about this game, the movement on this is just amazing. I can't believe like some of the, uh, like the, just the wall jumping and the uh, being able to double jump. I think that's freaking amazing. And I actually feel like the movement is just way better. Um, the Titans in this is definitely a benefit. Being able to have something to watch your back like that, that's way better than any kind of guard dog in my opinion. Uh, the weapons in this game too, I the one thing I don't really care for so far, I haven't figured out maybe, and that's part of it, um, how to change my weapons and how to make them my own. Don't know if that's something that's available for any of you that do play this game. Uh, please leave me some comments below on what to do, how that works. There's a Titan already. Awesome. I must have jumped in on one here. Not really sure how that works just yet. I missed him. Um, yeah, the quick changes of the weapon classes in this are amazing too. I like that I can just kind of go like this and switch between whatever I want to be here. Yeah, this pistol here too is another one I kind I like it personally so far. At least in the training mode, it was pretty cool. I don't know how well it works on the game itself. Come here, Titan. Come here, Titan. Come here, bitch. Oh, he got me. Ah, uh, the graphics on this too. The graphics I cannot get over. They are just some really amazing graphics to me. Uh, way better than Ghosts, in my opinion, too. I really like Ghosts on the one, um, graphics-wise, but I'm just really not into that game. Uh, like I said once in my update video, we did decide not to do this as a clan. I do plan on doing a little work with Ghosts. I don't know when. Um, and it's actually really going to be pretty much just my opinions and thoughts of the game. I really don't have matches to show. I might try to do a couple montages with that. Uh, if that's something you guys would want to see, please let me know in the comments below in this video. God damn. Them Titans are not nice. Oh. Yeah, it's going to take me a little getting used to this. To this. Uh, very fun, though. Definitely something I don't know that I'll be... I don't know that I'll be on any other game for a while. Uh, so if any of you guys that follow me play this, you know where to find me. And if you guys... Uh, like this live commentary let me know I'll definitely do, do more of this um, the other thing too I went to go practice I wanted to try to get a little feel of the game first and usually the way I do that is in the uh, private matches and stuff I realized when I went to go do this that I couldn't do this by myself so if any of you guys like I said play this and have it for the Xbox one please hit me up I uh, definitely need to get a little bit better of a feel for this and I know the best way obviously is to oh shit be in the match, but as you guys can see, uh, I'm definitely not used to this big map play. Uh, the Ghosts was kind of the first for me when it came to that, as far as a war game. Oh, I got my Titan. Now. It's on. Uh, but yeah, I want to get used to these maps more. These are actually really interesting, and it's actually a good thing I think in my or in this situation when there are these big robots chasing your ass to have like a good space to run and hide. I, it's just so far and I like that actually that the enemies are visible all the time on the map too it, it, considering these are so big damn die 
I actually I take that back. I did have a little bit more experience in the bigger map situations with Battlefield three and four, but I really couldn't get into them. Uh, don't know if it was just because I didn't really have too many people I liked playing with, or if the game is really crap. I don't really know. You guys, let me know in the comments what you thought about those games. Uh, definitely something I I still have them. Something I've thought about playing and doing some uh, video work with, but I don't know. I kind of feel like this is more the area I should be going with it. Um, the, yeah, some of my thoughts too on Ghosts while I was talking about it there. Um, I think the new add-ons are just ridiculous. Um, Black Ninja 901, some of his videos, he talks about that. I definitely agree. I think that they're going the wrong direction to get the promotions they want. Um, I think that, uh, <laughs> I think that I saw something the other day when I got on about Predator, uh, I just thought that was a little ridiculous. I do like the extinctions on that, however, that is definitely something I play. I kind of prefer that over zombies just because I feel like they fight back a hell of a lot harder. And it gives me more of a challenge in it. The zombies is fun too, but I'm just kind of over that at this point. Oh, I really need to watch my back. <laughs> um, I was kind of disappointed in all the hype on ghosts. I really feel like there was not really a cause for that. I it was kind of overkilled. Uh, it, I was so excited for it, and then I got it, and I was just really disappointed. I Don't get me wrong, I do like some things from it, and I don't mind playing it, but I think I'd still... I, it's kind of. It was kind of sad that I preferred still to play Black Ops 2 over that. Um, I was really kind of over. Ooh, nice. I was really kind of over... Why are you jumping, motherfucker? I was really kind of over um, Black Ops 2 until Ghost came out, and then it was just like I was ready to go back. Uh, the other thing in Ghosts, um, I like I said, I might do a little video work with that. It's I don't really know. It's not something I even really put in. I have it for both the 360 and the One, and I think I've played probably a total of less than 24 hours total. <laughs> Pretty sad, but uh, oh shit! Yeah, definitely enjoying this game though. Yeah. I, like I said, I think I'll be hooked for a while. Oh shit, there you go. Yeah, if you guys enjoy this and enjoy uh, seeing the uh, gameplay from this and any of the commentary, please leave a like. And definitely subscribe because there will definitely be more of this to come. Uh, also too, I wanted to remind you guys, at 100 subs, I do plan on... Uh, I do plan on doing the Sprite and Banana challenge for you guys. If you guys haven't seen any of the other challenge videos, like I said, the links for them will be in the description. I have fun doing them. They may not be exactly a video game, but to me, a game, period, is any kind of challenge to yourself. And so I hope you guys have kind of a similar thought. And if so, please, like I said, go check those out. And <laughs> uh, Guardian on uh, Twitter suggested for me to do that Banana and Sprite challenge. And I really like that idea. It's not the first time I've heard that. I've watched a few of them videos. <laughs> I know what the reaction's gonna be, and I'm actually prepared for it. I think that's just a little sad that I'm not prepared for that. Damn, I got two of them on me. No. Oh, this definitely is not easy, but it's definitely exciting. I think my adrenaline's going more now than it would be at all ever playing any kind of Call of Duty at this second. That's pretty sad. Oh, my thoughts too about that new Call of Duty coming out. I agree with a lot of you guys. I think that they better test their game and have a lot of it fixed before it comes out, especially with the Xbox One's update or the load time or download time. Sorry, uh, the download time's already crap, and so all these fixes and stuff when the game's already out. I want to play the game. I don't want to spend you know two hours waiting for it to download. Otherwise, by that time, I'm over it, and I don't even really want to play no more. Oh, man, I am getting slaughtered. I can't believe it. I'm in second place on my team. I must not be the only one that's new to this at the second. Uh, yeah, and at 300 subs, too, I am working on a sniper montage. It's our next Call of Duty project. If you guys are interested in seeing a sneak peek of that, all I'm asking for is 300 followers on Twitter. You can get me up to that. Um, there's been some pictures posted if any of you guys are editors yourself and know you know, a little bit about what that looks like. Oh, I guess I'm out of the game. Uh, but if you guys know what that looks like, you can tell what I've done on that project. I do try my best uh, learning a lot of new things, getting some information from a lot of you guys that follow and are supportive of this. 
and I got my ass kicked on this. But anyway, guys, I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that. I had a lot of fun doing this. This was my very first commentary. If you guys did like this, again, please click the like button and subscribe. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.